I'd like to start my presentation. Hacking first by, by Tatsuhiro Ujihisa. Hi. Konnichiwa. Uh, uh, I'm from Japan. Uh, before, my, uh, before I start my presentation, uh, I have to say this disclaimer. This presentation is not for super previous or Ruby committers, but for ordinary programmers. I think uh, Ruby committers is my presentation is too easy. Uh, is there any Ruby committers? Okay. Uh, so uh, most of them are not Ruby committers. It's good for me. Uh, I'm not good at English, particularly in listening English. But uh, you can, uh, if you don't understand something, you can ask, you can uh, ask a question to me, whatever, uh, whenever you want. Even though I'm not sure I can uh, respond. So uh, today I'll talk about Fuzzby. Fuzzby is uh, Fuzzby handle Ruby syntax. Uh, today's Matt's keynote uh, in Matt's keynote, Matt said that uh, inside uh, internal DS DSL is always good. Uh, some people use Ruby uh, use Ruby syntax. Uh, some people use I've used Ruby syntax, but uh, Ruby has limitations. Uh, we cannot write something uh, over the Ruby syntax. So uh, today's my presentation breaks the limitations. Um, to understand further, Ruby's further, uh, this presentation will introduce, will fix the Ruby's further to add some new syntax. Through this experience, we can understand Ruby's further more and more. Uh, uh, if you feel, uh, if you cannot see the bottom of the slide, uh, you can move into front piece. Uh, there are many uh, empty pieces, so you can move anytime. You can walk around anytime. So uh, I'll introduce new syntax. I have only 45 minutes, so I don't <laughs> think I can show all of them, but uh, I'd like to introduce some of them. Okay, first of all, I'd like to introduce the first one. B before that, uh, Matt's Ruby implement, uh, I talk about Matt's Ruby implementation. Uh, MRI is, uh, you, you, I think you know MRI has two major versions, 1.8 as a stable version and 1.9 as an unstable version. Today I talk about 1.9.2 today. Uh, in my MacBook here, um, latest Ruby is inside. That's today's 2009, November 19th. And uh, Matt Ruby implementation is written in C. Uh, what's the difference between Ruby 1.8 and 1.9? 1.8 further is first byte. And the evaluator was evaluated to C. There are only two core files. Uh, one point in 1.9 further was is still part by, but why uh, pa the evaluator was replaced from evaluator to C to Yarp. Yarp is consist of VM and something that C. Uh, Matt said in Ruby Conf 2006, uh, Ruby has two ugly parts. Ruby is inside it. Ru two ugly parts. One is evaluator to C, and two the, s uh, the other is part that's why. Now the uh, original evaluator, evaluator to C, was all replaced with Yarp. So I'll talk about the rest of Ivory files today. MRI use Yak. Uh, Pass by is what will be a uh, process such like. Uh, Pass by is, as uh, I said previously, one of the darkest side. Uh, when in uh, when, uh, Ruby source code, I type this one to calculate how 
how long is the length of the each file. Path.c is the longest file, but it's automatically generated one. The second longest file is path.y. It's 10,000, more than 10,000 lines. <coughs> and what's the further? Further has uh, two meaning. One uh, broader meaning and uh, narrow meaning. Narrow meaning. Uh, the broader meaning, further as a broad meaning, it has two process. The first one is lex lexer, lexing. And the second one is uh, narrow, further in narrow meaning. Lexer makes uh, byte uh, or Ruby source code string to uh, symbols in uh, each chunk. Symbols are or token. Uh, I, think, I think saying token is better because symbol is ambiguous word, which is Pazza's uh, word for or Ruby's symbol. So I'll talk to, I'll say uh, symbols, uh, I'll say token as symbols. And then the sequence of symbols were converted to syntax tree by the parser. And this list is the tokens in a lexer in which defined it in a path.y. For example, the uh, left top one, k plus t u plus is a token unary plus. So uh, Ruby has unary operation, op operation, operators, uh, plus something, minus something, this is one. And others are uh, like this. On the other hand, uh, MATLAB implementation has more than 10,000 lines. While other, how about other Ruby implementation? JRuby has uh, separated file, and uh, in total, there we have more than uh, 24,000 lines. And Rubinias has uh, many files, but as a this one is grammar.py, it's 5,000 lines. Anyway, I talk about the first one, but that's why. So, look this one. In Ruby, uh, Ruby has hash literal, and uh, the hash the uh, association operator. This looks like emoticon. <laughs> <laughs> nice timing. So uh, we expect that we can write this instead of this. <laughs> so. Uh, Let's master the colon in Ruby. Ruby's colon has several meanings. The first one is uh, colon colon. It's uh, names to separate, to uh, define the namespace. The second example is for uh, write symbol. The third one is uh, conditional operator. The fourth one is uh, hash association operator, which is newly introduced in Ruby 1.9. And the last one is only in Ruby 1.8. This, the, the column is then, then one, then something. And this is uh, part of path.y. When uh, Ruby's lexa see the next character, next one character, and the next one character is uh, char character colon. Ruby does will do something. If there are colon colon, the two sequence of colon, it's a colon colon. Maybe t colon two or t colon three. Token colon two or token colon three. Token colon two is uh, uh, like. Uh, is the namespace and token column three is the first names pass, uh, absolute pass. I don't know that um, name, but you can understand by this tree, this right. And how to uh, distinguish the following the two? Uh, it's uh, the how to distinguish the two 
columns, two types of column by Lexa. The answer is the, colon, uh, the Lexa has state. When Lexa see colon, after the something like class name, the colon maybe uh, will be colon two. Else, uh, otherwise, the colon colon is colon, colon three. And Lex states has the several, Lex has several kind of states. The first one is expression being, it's uh, like uh, just after the new line. For example, uh, for example the, uh, the uh, very beginning of the line. In explore beginning state, if there's plus, plus thing, if there's plus symbol, it's a sign, not a uh, binary operation, not plus operation. And then mm, X will be find colon, and then will be find colon again, the third line. And then, and if the state is beginning and uh, something, 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 the, the colon, colon, it's T colon, token colon three. Otherwise, the last one is two. And then uh, if the state is something, this is colon return column is this is this will be the next uh, this will uh, this is the conditional operator. And then if the following uh, uh, otherwise there will be the colon is symbol the start of symbol. So uh, in summary, how does the person deal with colon? If the uh, strings uh, colon colon, it, it may be t colon two or t colon three. Otherwise, uh, if, if the state is expression end, it's, it's the colon of a conditional operator. Otherwise, it's the start of symbol. So uh, we can add the, if the Lex find colon and hyphen and the closing parent, uh, it returns T, this is the token of the hash association operation. So let's add this now. Can you see the letter? <laughs> <laughs> okay, ah, it's difficult to hold the mic. Thank you very much. This is the inside of mat uh, this is the inside of Matro implementation of the source code. There are some files. Uh, this is past life. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry to say I will uh, fix the size a little smaller. Okay. And this is uh, one thousand, uh, ten thousand, more than. Of course, uh, the current Ruby doesn't have the such detail. Uh, this is okay, but this may be syntax error. Yeah. <coughs> okay, now I fix the first look right. Let's find here. Uh, if we the next find colon and then next then next character is hyphen. And then next character is this one. This is the 
fit. This is the east. Oh, thank you. <laughs> it's very uh, good. Okay, that's nice. I'm making store. No, it's building. Uh, how many people have uh, have built on your own Ubi? And how many people pick the way? <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, you know. <laughs> <laughs> mm, MacBook Air yeah, is a little slow. <laughs> uh, if, you, uh, fine. if you have uh, any question, you can ask me now. Okay. How do you pronounce this this one? This one? Red French. Thank you. So uh, this is left French. In Japan, this is called Kakko, and this is called Kokka. <laughs> <laughs> it's very popular thing. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's not still working. <laughs> Um, okay, uh, I, I talk the next topic. Uh, this code has <coughs> bug. Can you find the bug? The bug? This, this code has two bugs. Right. And there's one more bug. It may be difficult. The answer is uh, you have to change the index. <coughs> hmm. <laughs> now it's making there maybe. Oh, okay. Now it's making finish, and then it will trying to make the store. Ah, uh, no, 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 not yet, but soon. Oh! I think <laughs> that's because of the bug. So I try again. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh, okay, let's find the bug. <laughs> uh, syntax error before closing the store. Where's the bug? Here, okay. Uh -huh. I think only this slide. Sorry? There is no pull in parenthesis for the. Uh, no, that's <laughs> right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
なんかこう怖い内容はない。I think there are a lot of risk in this program. In this, you, you can write symbol as not symbol at all. Like, uh, first, write a single quotation and then, and the, before, and the, uh, the, the sequence before the spaces. I, for you, Ruby is a cosmos. I, I have succeeded in. But the patch is very ad hoc one. So the bottom example may be syntax error because the first between the first uh, quotation and the second quotation maybe uh, will be string and then be not allowed here. So uh, how will we handle single quote? It's very simple. If we will be fine single quote. Uh, Ruby, the lexer change the lexer story. Uh, the lexer change the state to be the next, the following, the following sequence is a symbols one, and then it returns token symbol begin. So uh, to add the list like symbol syntax, we can. It's uh, the only one thing to do uh, is uh, adding the for following the. Code. If something are true, the next state it starts <coughs> the beginning of uh, name, and then it returns the token symbol beginning. Oh, back to the topic. Did the make finished? Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, <coughs> so uh, yeah. what 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 to try? Excuse me. I have the, uh, I have those patches about for password why, and I apply the risk write symbol patch, but it will break the make process, so it's very difficult to. <laughs> now, <laughs> why it's uh, too slow? Usually, it's it's more faster than today. Maybe my math book here is faster. Ruby find single quotation. The following uh, string is uh, a symbol or string. So uh, holding flag, it may be symbol or string. Uh, in default, uh, by default, it's symbol. And the vector be the following letter until the special magic number. <laughs> 
and the vector find spaces until the it reach the uh, length of string or new line. It may be it can be a symbol. Otherwise, it it will uh, it it can be string. Otherwise, it will be symbol. Very, you can understand it's very uh, ad hoc, so uh, Ruby commit does never accept this kind. I never accept this. Why? <laughs> oh, oh, I understand. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> There's uh, one more. There is there was still bug. <laughs> yeah. Uh, now I feel now I will, I bug the file. Yeah. Sorry. Some people is discussing the pushback is a bad thing. Oh. Okay. Okay, I'll explain why I say this is funny. The, uh, in Ruby building, uh, uh, during the, ru the building of Ruby, Ruby used mini Ruby. Uh, Ruby used the part of Ruby itself to compile Ruby. And uh, uh, the pushback was called, uh, <coughs> next C pushback, the infinity call. Uh, the, uh, the if the first con the condition was Fault, it will be pushed back. So never we can go <laughs> through. So the making uh, building was infinite loop. So it will be finished soon. Or never end. And peak is a loop and back. Uh, the next scene, if you oh, mm -mm, yeah. <laughs> you mean this one? Yeah. Okay. But the building may be finished because there's no column. I <coughs> but I have to stop the building. Very useful. <laughs> okay, before I start my following topic, do you know the Ruby's uh, very useful syntax? This one? I'm using IRB now. Now my MacBook is overheating.
they are, you know, the unary operator plus. Oh, you, can you see me? Plus one is literally equal to plus one. And you can write plus plus one. It, is, it will be plus by this kind. So you can write plus 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 y. This is very useful for separating source code without comment. And if you define a projecty can write something Yay. <laughs> <laughs> this demonstration shows how I'm an ordinary programmer. Mm, why is it in this display? It's in, why is it space long time? Mm. Mm, I'd like to show the Usually the speed is very fast. But today is very slow. Why? Oh. Do you have any question about my previous talk? Pass of y file. It's very long, but uh, pass of y define uh, spec space be begin with the line 16. This is expression begin, expression end, expression end r, expression commander. Yes, many. Going but big slow. And then we <coughs> find some macros. And some define something.
follow it, right? Just go in. Sorry, I'd like to uh, continue the presentation. Okay, uh, now I'd like to introduce incremental operator. Plus plus i is uh, literally called i call i that task field. Uh, there's one another definition, uh, i equals i plus one, but uh, i that task field is more, I think, it's more natural. Uh, this change doesn't uh, break the normal Ruby source code, but uh, as I said, you know, as I demonstrated in uh, IRB, uh, plus 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 as uh, uh, horizontal line. If you use such source, such code in a, your, your source code, it m that such may break your Ruby. <laughs> <laughs> but it's useful. Um, first of all, we have to add, add one more token in uh, Lex. It's very similar to, it's very similar to unary plus, so I added up after the unary u plus. This is t increment, uh, whatever you want, uh, you, you can change the name, t input. And then uh, we can, we hit id that h, this is a table file. This is automatically made by make file. And Ruby, and then I will talk, I talk about the narrow meaning of parser. Ruby's parser is uh, written in uh, like like BNS. You know. uh, for example, variable is a uh, identifier or instance variable or global variable or constant or a uh, three variable uh, and or uh, a lot of things. And this is an uh, example. Uh, left hand statement is a variable or a primary value or something. And the, uh, bracket from the bracket to the close bracket, the right bracket, this is a side effect. For example, uh, <coughs> the assign number the, is a guard for ob object. The variable is a assign, the variable should be assignable. If the variable isn't assignable, uh, this the code will be syntax will be ra will raise syntax error, and this is a part of Ruby's BNS. Ruby is uh, the source code is program, and program is cons uh, comp statement. Comp statement is uh, uh, the sequence of statement. Statement is a noun or statement or some statement, and statement one statement is uh, something uh, includes expression. Expression is something uh, blah blah blah. There's many uh, deep free. Uh, this is very deep free structure. Uh, assignment. Assignment is uh, like this is MLHS M a large left hand statement. And equal and command call is one of the example of assignment. For example, uh, A column B equals uh, C dot uh, D is uh, this case. If the left hand statement is a value, and so and then the left hand statement the uh, node value is the command call. The dara uh, it means the dara one is MLHS, dara two is equal, dara three is command call. This is a reference. And dara dara is the whole value of the um, MLHS and equals and command code. So this assignment, this uh, code, it will process uh, assign the command call to MLHS, and uh, this whole expression, uh, this whole statement value is the uh, is the MLHS. By the way. Oh, 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 oh. 
I'm sorry to say my uh, build was very late. But uh, remember that uh, I, will, I will Ruby code to show uh, the emoticon hash association. Let's begin demonstration. This is the ordinary hash. Oh, wait. Result.rb.irb.rt. Mm, booting IRB is taking long time. OK. This is the ordinary hash. And uh, I, I expect I can write. Oh, yes. <laughs> Sometimes it causes segmentation fault. <laughs> <laughs> of course, we can write this one without space. Oh, cool. <laughs> this is very useful. <laughs> anyway, so, uh, and then uh, we introduced this bike one. So uh, this is a uh, git control. The git branch is the free one. Incremental operator, OK, git checkout, incremental operator. B is the git branch, and C is the git checkout. Now I'm checking, checking it. Oh, wait. Oh, why? Oh, okay, okay, I see. I did. I forgot to do this. <coughs> now, nah, what I, uh, I, I will explain what I did. I did the, uh, I applied the patch of uh, incremental operator plus plus one. And now I'm building. So, uh, let let me explain how the plus plus patch works. Uh, T info. T info means plus plus info. If Ruby finds t equal plus and variable, uh, but first of all, the variable should be assignable. And then uh, the variable calls succeed and the result and assigns the result to the uh, whole node. And then it turns it. So it's uh, uh, exactly the same as. Uh, I, uh, plus plus I is exactly the same as I equals I that succeed. Okay, now it's still building. And the left hand statement, M multi left hand statement, is a very uh, esoteric structure, but there's, I think there's m some reasons. M L multi left hand statement is a uh, uh, multi left hand statement basic, and the basic is head. Head is item and something. Item is node. Node is variable. I I don't know why there are some steps. A uh, method call is a uh, uh, new call. Uh, two method call to call a method. We can use the macro new call. This is a uh, dollar one is the, the second line block call. Dollar two is that. Dollar three is operation two. Operation two is 
this is something like a uh, method name. And therefore, it's the argument. It's very uh, comprehensive. The block call dot operation to quanta args value <coughs> is the result of a new call that I'll uh, block call operation to quanta args. This is the, in, in other words, this is the de definition of method calls that. And let's mix this. Ah, this is a patch, so I introduce. If Ruby finds the incremental and variable, Ruby assigns the, uh, Ruby should, Ruby got the variable is assignable, and then the result of succeed of variable, and then uh, assign the result of the succeed of variable to the whole variable. Okay, let's see the make was finished. Oh, not finished. I need more confidence here. Anyway, uh, I think uh, people once uh, think why Ruby do doesn't have plus plus, particularly for C programmer, from P C programmer. Uh, does anybody know why Ruby doesn't have plus plus? This is a uh, uh, basically is assignment, but uh, plus plus is a, uh, uh, we can write plus plus everywhere. It's very uh, mm, like dangerous. Uh, it's very not comprehensive for humans. I think that's why uh, Matt disagree with introducing plus plus. I saw uh, some person. I saw a person who suggested uh, how about introducing plus plus in Ruby in the Ruby core mailing list and few minutes ago Matt rejected it. It's very uh, fast. <laughs> and I think there's some patches here also. Hmm. Uh, I, this time I introduced plus plus i, uh, without, uh, pr pr i plus plus, because i plus plus the uh, post incremental was very difficult to introduce because uh, it, we have to save the value in uh, other variable. Yes. Hmm. Now I know I, I'm over the, my time, but I'd like to show the demonstration of plus plus. But it's very, but it's slow. Uh, oh, oh, it will finish soon. Well, I make, uh, I have been making Ruby every day, but, uh, it's for it's first time for me to. It takes very long time. Hmm. And my presentation is almost finished, so relax. Now I just I. Uh, I just want to show that. Oh, oh, oh. make it finish. Oh no, there's one more other. <laughs> now Ruby is making Reaper and building Reaper that way. But I, I don't use Reaper, so I, I want to skip this process. <laughs> <laughs> and there are some conflicts. But we can ignore it this time. Okay, come on. I think we want, uh, we want, I, I think this is because this 
must be root AI is uh, overheating. <laughs> Now Ruby is building the Ruby file with the pipes. Mm. Okay, it takes very long time than what I expected. So before that, I'll show my conclusion of my presentation. Okay. Okay. It, this is my reference book. Ruby is uh, hacking. I uh, it's only in Japanese, but Ruby source code convention crisis. This is very uh, good book. Uh, this book hacks Ruby's inside, uh, Ruby's father, and Ruby's evaluator, and other Ruby's. <coughs> this is written by Minero Aoki and Uki from Matsumoto. Uh, I hope this one uh, is available also in English, but unfortunately, this is only in Japanese. There's, a, there's an effort to uh, translate the book yeah, into Yeah, there's translation, but not all. Right. Uh, other reference. Uh, all of my patches I introduced today were uh, written in my blog. Oh! <laughs> okay, remember that I added plus plus to Ruby. And now I'll try it. I hope it doesn't take segmentation force. <laughs> because I've never tried today's Ruby. <laughs> okay. I code zero. And plus plus I. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and plus plus is succeed, so uh, we can plus plus. <laughs> Yay. So, uh, I'm sorry to say uh, my presentation was very, uh, no, no, very, very bad in uh, demonstration. <laughs> I, I, I didn't think what. I don't know why this took very long time, but uh, my presentation was all. Thank you very much. <laughs>